Good morning. Um, okay, so for this one, I can see what you're doing. So you got the, the plus three part, totally correct. Plus three would be left three, so that's awesome. And then right here, I can see you're trying to stretch by three, I think, and that's why you have that one three above. The problem is this point is now over here. Um, and so do the stretch before you do the shift, and it'll be way easier. So let me show you what I mean by that. Um, clear this. So that's our parent function. So ours is going to be here. And instead of going up one, because um, for square root x, if you take square root of zero, it's zero. Square root of one is one. So those are your two initial points. Instead of going up one, if it had a three in front of it, it's going to be three times one or three. It's going to be three times as bigger. So that is this without that shift. Um, if you look over here, when x was 4, the output was 2, and now it's going to be 2, 4, 6. It's three times as big. So it's much easier to do the stretch first when you have it, you have the original one relative. Um, if I were doing this on pencil and paper, I would totally graph that original one and then do this and then take this and shift it over. Um, so now for the plus 3 shift, in terms of the computer, Something you can do is just physically move each of these points. So I'm going to pick this one up and move it one, two, three, and I'll take this one and move it one, two, three. So there I maintain that same shape. It's going over one, up three, instead of over one, up one, and it's shifted um, three to the left. Hopefully that helps.